some of the camping gear we got from where did I get it from? Anaconda and other bits and places. Beast, bear, bear, beast, you have to go there much anymore. But uh, in here I've got plastic tongs, fork, spoons, knife, flip, my cup, which we're going to boil up some water, have a coffee, little saucepan. Yeah, salt and pepper, and my little frying pan. This here I got from um, eBay. I've been looking for a while because it, it's wider and you can open them up okay. and it's bigger for the pan. So, and plus um, the flames are a lot wider and you can turn it down a lot better to get uh, a nice steady flow instead of burning the, the food. What brand is it? Brand, I don't know. Just an eBay sort of thing. What brand uh, your pots? Pot. Uh, Cedar Summit. Pretty well everything is Cedar Summit. Always carry a Zippo because I never know what happens out here. Gets stranded or in the bush or something. Mm -hmm. so, which is nice and good because it's nice and wide. And you can turn the flame a fair way down. Have to do a take two. Nah. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, well, that sits a bit better. The magpies are interested in what uh, Bushy has to say. Hey, hello, magpie. Oh, we're going to boil some water, won't we? Have a cup of coffee while we're cooking. I did bring some water. Oh, there it is. The other thing I invested in was, um, I was gonna keep these, but, which is over on the bike. I'll be back in a minute. Yes, you can have some too, you cook. Stop being a greedy little chick. It's a mini water filter. Because later on I'll go down to the creek, fill her up, and have some fresh water. Doesn't matter where I am. I can actually piss in this and uh, drink can you, it. Can you piss in it and show us? Do a demonstration. Not, not, not today, I just had a leak before. <laughs> but apparently you can. So it's another little thing that I end up getting. What Once brand? again, you had an adventure, you don't know where you'd be. Brand um, Sawyer. Sawyer. And what can happen? Well, uh, you got a cup? No cup, no coffee. Don't want a coffee. I told you I didn't bring it. I told you to bring a cup. Let's try this and go. Well, I'll just have the uh, Italian espresso. <laughs> Have a look at the present. Open, they opened a present up. Not, it's not for you, but it's 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 me. Really? Well, this is a present. I uh, yeah. Oh, pushy. I, I I heeded your advice, and I went and got something. Ah, oh, you're kidding me. <laughs> <laughs> 
So, is that the guts out of the... That's the guts out of a $20 air compressor from Bunnings. And it was literally the same size as that bag. And now, that's what it is. Nice and micro size. Just don't hold it when it's gone. They do get hot. <laughs> I have learned that lesson. Oh, I've got to put, got to put the things back in. Oh. So, see, I've had all this camping gear for oh, eight months and I've never tried to use it. And today we decided to go out, even it was raining. And uh, I don't know, have a barbecue lunch. It was a good plan, Stan. Yes. But I, I like the idea that that did. But the one I was going to get was uh, nearly $80 off uh, MX store. It's the same design. Yeah. And um, it's got al al aluminium piston and everything else where some of the other ones you get off eBay were uh, plastic. But that there is good. I can come off the bike and won't damage it. Oh, so it's not taking not too bad to boil. What I'll do is when you pour your coffee on it, yeah, I'll do oh. that up. Oh no, I can clean it. I'll make a coffee yeah. in that. Do you want to get some water on that one, yeah. please? I've also got some powdered milk for the uh, coffee. Just things I'm going to try for when I do go away for a few days. Some stuff you can't take. I made the mistake of trying this at home once and used uh, hot water with it. Didn't work. Works a lot better with uh, cold water. That didn't take that long. That's hot. Sit that there. I think Nathan wants one later. Um, we'll put this on again. Probably when I got this, I had a couple of years to do it. Not a bit, but we'll probably need to do it. Okay. Yeah. 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 Anyway, both of us saying we've got to better the, do what a bit of the stuff. Get the chemicals out of it. Get the mouth clear. Both all right to me. Anyway, as I said, got some powdered milk. That'll be enough for me coffee. Ta da! Just trying different things, learning different things. Oh, that looks all right. I just need my moccasins. You need your moccasins? Right, <laughs> oh, no. See how this goes. Absolutely superb. So Nathan will have a coffee later, so I'll leave that there. You wouldn't even know. Right, I turn this on, get a bit of oil. The other thing I tried too, which uh, Joy's got at home, she's my lovely wife, is um, some sort of butter. But it stays in the jar and you can leave it in the uh, in the cupboard. If anyone knows what I'm talking about, just leave a comment down the bottom. I've used it at home, works all right. Oh, you got a little burn there. So that's it there.
The other thing I do too is um, at home I get some uh, cooking oil, cut up a few garlic cloves, put it in the oil, leave it in the fridge, and I know a few days later I go and use the oil, garlic, beautiful, all the way through the oil. I cook, cook chips in there and they'll get the, the garlic, a bit of uh, garlic taste through the chips. What do you want? Have you chopped the onion? Onion is chopped. Oh, cool. Uh, I have... So is me doing the lady Cheese. Thing. I have onion. And I have sugar, garlic, chili, mixed herbs. <laughs> I have everything. Number one rule, always take your rubbish home. It's so annoying you go somewhere, people just leave it lying around. It really shits me. And it's not the right thing to be doing. No wonder the parks close down things. You like chilli? Yeah. I'll try about chilli sausages. Oh yeah, chilli sausage, that's right. So I might put a bit of chilli with the uh, Ooh, oh yeah, yes. baby. Burnade. Got love burnade. <laughs> Killing the onion. Garlic. Beautiful. Oh, that's good. The, uh, if you ever got a dirty barbecue plate, one of the best things is to clean your plate is onion. Uh, did you bring plates? <laughs> well, plates, you want to butter some bread, please? How's that butter, butter buttering bread? There's that. Yeah. Yeah, how's that stuff of buttering bread? Is it any good? Yeah. Well, I'm going to eat it. Of course you're going to eat it. Ooh, my coffee! So, do you like powdered milk? Yeah. It's one of those things that... Uh, tastes like shit or... <laughs> yeah, like uh, Paul Hogan says, tastes like shit, but you can live on it. Sure. Better than nothing. That's hot too. The other thing you can get is the... Um, uh, cream tubes. Oh. If you're born enough. I said, no, just grab a couple of sausages. I don't only have one. Oh, look at that. It's enough for the pan. Enough for the family. <laughs> How many you want? Uh, I'll go about four. Just cook three up for now. Four? Yeah. Oh, whatever you, what you can put in there. I'll oh, cook yeah. the onions. I'll cook the other ones while we're eating. Yeah. I want crispy anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The other thing too is why I bring a Zippo. Doesn't matter how windy it is, they still go. And if you're riding, you come off in the river, they work. Um, and they're really good. I saw one the other day, it was a, a, battery, a rechargeable battery one. And but it, like you can't dry, you can only light a fire, but that was it. Like at least if you come off in the river and you take your spark plug out, you can light these up, dry the, well it's hot, dry the uh, spark plug out with it. The other reason I like this setup, so like I said, it's, it, the 
bigness in here, the flame spreads the heat out of the pan, where a lot of the other ones have just got the small hole and just sends that heat up in them. I like that. Mm. Oh, good. <laughs> that is sweet. You, you can't, if you want it. You can't taste it. Good. That looks good. Yeah. yeah, typically you just run a bottle through it and it pulls out all the powder chemical and then it's good to go. It lasts about six months, I think. And then you've got to buy a new one. Oh, uh, longer than that, I read about it. Uh, they start growing algae in it. Yeah, but you just change the filter. Yeah, that's yeah. what I mean, yeah. six months. Yeah. Yeah. So the other, other, other one I've got is this one here. The other one I've got too, is this here. Which I use a fair bit too. It opens up, but you can see here it's a lot smaller. The flame where this one here is nearly twice the size. So, first time using this one, I've used this one uh, quite a few times in the four wheel drive and going away. goes in the tub. Supposed to. Joys of uh, editing. Get in there. Just uh, it looks like real butter. Yeah, one of those luxuries you can take when you go away. Yeah. I told you to bring your cup and your plate and that. I forgot it. Quite nice having a talk. Yeah, the other thing too, which I didn't put on. They get warm. I just grabbed it. Ooh, that was a bit hot. <laughs> Another good little uh, idea and trick too is um, those black things you can buy at Bunnings or other barbecue places to put on your barbecue. You can get them and just cut them out to whatever shape you want and just a portable little plate to put your food on while you're cooking the rest. And uh, they just fold up to next to nothing. Oh. And I brought one of the best things you could ever take to a barbecue. And uh, Nathan's going to love it. And my other son, Chris, loves it. And everyone else who I give this stuff to enjoys it. There's people from Queensland come down, they always ask me. Bushy, can you make some sauce? And I normally do. On rare occasions. <laughs> it's in here. It's uh, chili, it's garlic. It is a superb, nice sauce. The steak, sausages. Anything. Told you I had a surprise. Spaghetti bolognese. Forget oh, anything. Bit of a ingredients. Oh, mightn't look very good, but I tell you what, 
That's good stuff. Burns the ring. Mm. <laughs> That's lunch. That's not bad. Not bad. We can smell the chili. Mm. They're not bad snacks. They have chili in them. Full gourmet ones. Gourmet lunch time. Good stuff. Mm. Oh, that. oh, that sauce is good. Yeah. Hey, uh, everyone loves me sauce. Well, we finished having lunch. As you can see, everything's clean. Um, the way we should leave it. Bit of a re review. Hang on a minute. I'll have a few drinks and, and fuck around with all this stuff and have a laugh. Well, what did I do that for? What did I do that for? <laughs> While we're out here, we'll just do a bit of a review on the um, Ridge, Ridge Gear Venture waterproof bag. Um, first time I've used them out in the bush and with the gear in it, impressed. Very, they are very good. Oh yeah, come over and have a look at this. This one empty. I think they are 20 odd litres a hole. Uh, I got me little table on top but they've worked really well today they're, they're a, a soft a soft billion so if you come off they're, all, they're pretty good um, yeah I like them uh, and they are waterproof they fold over quite a few times and uh, and lock in and clamp in and with other other products you can just put it over and uh, and just just cl just clip it in so I can't remember how much they were, but uh, they were from the uh, MX store. Very impressed. The other review I was going to do is this little Bluetooth setup here, which is the BT S2 Pro 2. Um, I paid 140 bucks for it. Um, close range, they work okay. Um, if you get uh, around a corner or so, uh, you start dropping out. Um, I'll show you later on how far we'll, we'll get going. But for the money, they're okay. Um, I wouldn't expect them to go, you know, they do the job. If someone comes off behind you, uh, 
you can hear them. So, which is, which is okay. They come as a pair? Yeah, they came as a pair at 140. Uh, Nathan's been using his. What do you think, Nathan? They're pretty good. Uh, they do drop out every now and then, but other than that, uh, if the microphone's in the right place, they're really good for the price, definitely. definitely for the price, good. yeah. They've yeah. come in handy and paid for themselves numerous times with corners and uh, stuff like that. Just uh, oh, the vehicles coming the other way. Yeah, trees on the road. Yeah. They're like, like I said, they're they're good if if you're close. Um, Shortly we'll head off and um, we'll start riding and I'll tell you when, when he drops out, which will be literally, uh, if you're 40 metres in front and you're going around a couple of corners, that's it, I can't hear him. Battery life? Battery life, uh, so far we've been out for about six hours riding and uh, they've been, been pretty good that way. Yeah, but once again, um, you get what you pay for and like Nathan said, uh, they've they have helped and worked. Uh, they pay for themselves in a sense uh, for the money. Uh, like if there's another bike coming, you yell out bike, bloody push bike riders, um, other other vehicles, etc. etc. Logs on the road, um, especially when someone's behind you and they fall off, and you hear this, oh, <laughs> you start laughing. Anyway, we'll be back. <laughs> 